Guys, Raven Coin. It's new, it's cool, it's mineable, whether it's CPU or GPU. You got an overstock CEO putting money into it. Let's get started. So I use uh, Yimp as a place where I go and do a lot of mining, their pool, right? And I've started seeing this RVN everywhere, and I was going to Coin Market Cap and putting RVN in, and it's not on Coin Market Cap. And I'm like, well, if it's not on Coin Market Cap, I didn't, I didn't really think, how could that even, how could that even work? Well, this thing's not listed on an exchange right now, um, but it's out there. It's been out there for a couple months, I believe, maybe not a couple months. It's sometime in January, this coin came out called Raven Coin. Um, and it's built to be ASIC resistance. So the, the algorithm they use to mine blocks is, uh, it, it changes. Uh, I just read, read through the white paper really fast. Basically the algorithm changes in a way that makes ASICs really hard to keep up with. Um, and it makes it a lot easier for GPUs and CPUs to compete. So that's interesting, right? Um, it's not an exchange, so you say, well, if it's not an exchange, how could I, how could I sell it or buy it? Well, they have their own peer-to-peer -peer network uh, website um, application, whatever you want to call it, where you can go up and say, hey, I've got five thousand Raven coin. I'd like to sell it for, you know, hundred satoshis a piece. Um, so it's not on Coin Market Cap, but you can uh, you can get a wallet and you can get a miner and you can start mining this puppy. So let's get started. How do we do that? We go to ravencoin.com and ravencoin.com i made that up completely go to ravencoin.org it wasn't too far off and here you can read the white paper you can uh get the release of the actual code um a bunch of tweets about it and um hit right in this area is where you get some big information you want to spend most of your time on the uh the forum here or the rvn forum now this is what caught my eye when i went to yimp this morning um, I looked down here and saw, hey, we, we've added a Raven, a Raven uh, port, and it's going crazy. And looky here, the Overstock CEO says he put millions of dollars into this the, into this coin. So it caught my eye. It made me go read the article. Um, you know, Raven coins ASIC resistance. There's a lot of altcoins out there that are ASIC resistant, or they, or so they say. So I don't know if this is legit or not as far as whether it's going to be the next big thing. I don't know why this guy really felt the need to, to put a hundred, what do you say? He put millions of dollars into this. Um, all I know is that I started mining it. I'm, I'm mining it on my GPU and my CPU and the market's down right now. And so I'm bored and I'm mining some coins and it's, I'm successful at it. So I'm having fun. We'll see what happens. But uh, you might want to read this article. I'll put all these links on the description when I'm done, the white paper, the overstock article, um, all of that. So when you're on here, you'll follow your, the for, you want to get to the forum, right? So we go to the Raven coin forum. This is where you get a lot of information, a lot, you get more information here than you will on the website. Um, coin specs, important links. Here's your first link you need to get. You got to get a wallet. If you're going to mine this, you got to get a wallet. Um, I am using windows. So I click here. Okay. This brings me to, uh, GitHub. The Raven coin release uh, releases for their wallets. I pick Windows. I like to use the Qt application, so I chose the Qt application. It downloads the exe file. So once you've downloaded the, the file, you open it up, you get it going. If you've never used wallets before, you're going to want to do uh, an article or two. You're going to read an article or two, watch a video or two about how to save your private keys. If you lose your private keys uh, to your wallets, your money's gone. So you'll want to do what you need to do to get your private keys. Ask me if you if you have questions. Maybe I can put a video out on it. But uh, with the Q, with the QT application, all you do is go to come here to receive, make a label. You don't have to make a label. I like to make a label so I know where it comes from. Minor, right? Um, you, you'll type in the label. You say request payment. It'll come down here. You click on it. You double click on it, and here is your um, public address. This is what you would will put into your miners. Okay, your bat files. So you'll want to copy this address. You'll want this. So once you've done that, you have finished that step. Now you have a wallet. Now we need to get a mining application. So depending on what you're using, I have, I'm using two laptops and I have an NVIDIA um, 1060G, six gigabyte. I don't know if it's a G. Um, and so a little bit further down this 
page, you'll see a list for CPU miners or GPU miners, the NVIDIA one. So if you're doing NVIDIA, you'll, you'll click here. You're going to need the, this is basically CC miner, but it's a, it's a Raven version. You get their own version. Um, you'll click that. Uh, let me go over that first. So we'll go to uh, the Raven version, Windows binaries. It's a 7-zip, so you'll have to get 7-zip if you don't have it. You'll download this. You'll open this up into a folder. Quick sidebar, guys. Be ready if you haven't already done it for your virus software to squawk at you and think that uh, your, the mining application that you're downloading is a virus. This is normal, but act according to however you feel comfortable. Okay, so we've downloaded it. We've uh, put it somewhere. Um, we expand it with 7-zip, and you'll see a couple just basic uh, CMD or BAT files there waiting for you. Um, this is where you put your wallet in. All you gotta do is change your wallet address. So I, again, like I, I said, I use YIMP. Another uh, pool is 3 i another Supernova. They have quite a few that's listed on that forum site. Um, you'll right click, you'll edit into your back file, your batch file. Um, and all you wanna change is your uh, wallet ID, your wallet number that you got from the last step that I just showed you. You'll just stick it right in here. This is basically username, which is basically wallet. Plop that right in there. Or you could use mine if you want and just mine for me, but you probably don't wanna do that. You wanna mine for yourself. So once you have that in there, these, these should already be set for you. That's uh, an X16 algorithm. If you This right here is where you put whichever pool you wanna use. I like YIMP. Right now, it seems like YIMP is the biggest going for Raven uh, at this time. Um, and here's where you'd change your port if you wanted to, but I can put this all this information in the description if you need it. And you'll just save it as a .bat file, which is a batch file. So when I double click this, it's gonna it's gonna basically make this application get going. Okay, so we get it. You double click it, and basically it just pops open, and boom! After a couple minutes, let me see. I've been doing this for about two hours now. It'll start going. Uh, eventually, you'll start um, just adding shares. To the pool so you're saying here's some shares here's some shares here's some shares here's some shares that's what all these yeses are hey you're adding shares to the pool ha doesn't mean you're, you you got any money at this point or you got any coins at this point it just means that you're adding shares to the pool um so that when they find a block you get paid for whatever shares you added basically and, and it's a different payment system at every pool a lot of times it's just payment per proportion so uh we'll jump back over to yimp and go to my wallet so in here we can click wallet and down here we can just add in put in your wallet address and it'll start keeping stats for you you can see down in this region right here under the miners there's my wallet address you can see I've got two CPU miners going and a GPU miner um, and right now currently until then until they find a new block I have added 0.0072% of the shares that are out there. I mean, these things get in mind like crazy right now. Um, I think it went from going, nobody knowing anything about it to lots of people knowing a lot about it. So um, anyway, um, I'm, I'm making shares. So far I've made 23, 24 Ravens in about you know two hours of me trying to set up this stuff. So maybe a little longer, but right about t two hours. Um, and so that's the GPU. Let's go back to here. CPU is very simple, same thing. You're gonna download this, you're gonna open it up, you're gonna pop it open. It might look a little different, but all you're trying to do is pop in your um, wallet address and the location, the pool that you wanna mine to, save it as a bat, double click it, and you'll, uh, you'll get going. You're, no, I don't have my laptops upstairs. It'll it'll look a lot like this does. It's not going to be as fast as a GPU. Okay, GPUs just do a lot better with mining than CPUs. But your CPU will mine a little bit. Again, if you look at my stats, uh, my GPU is getting six and a half mega hashes per second. My CPUs are just tossing out fifty-seven kilo hashes a second or eighty-five kilo hashes a second. You know, again, this is just for fun. I have no idea what. Raven's even going for if it's going to go ever going to go for anything if it's ever going to hit an exchange um, the good news is you've got overstock CEO that says he's putting money into it it's easy to mine right now and it's something fun to do 
while the markets are down a little bit and there's not a lot of great fun stuff to do right now besides this. So hope I helped you. Um, if you have any other questions, let me know. Let me think real quick. Is there anything else I'm missing? If you keep going down this um, uh, forum site, you'll see more pools that are recommended. And they got swag. <laughs> need to buy some Raven swag friends because this is kind of cool it's really one of the coolest little logos I've seen so far it's a little coin it has something to do with Game of Thrones you know the Ravens that carry the messages um, so that's Raven coin have fun